I have always been an unequivocal, uncompromising supporter of women's reproductive rights. Responding to attacks from several rivals, Paul Vallis told female supporters today that he would work to protect access to abortion if elected mayor. Opponents have publicized this interview from more than a dozen years ago in which Vallis both said he opposes abortion but then added that he opposes legislation restricting access to the procedure. And our political editor Mike Flannery joins us here with more, Mike. Well, Natalie and Anthony, reminiscent of President Biden on this issue, Vallis says his religious beliefs oppose abortion, but when it comes to public policy, he believes those who want abortion services should have full access to them. As long as I am mayor, this city will be a safe haven for women to exercise those rights, whether they live in Chicago or they come from somewhere else. Abortion providers here report an increase in women from other states seeking abortions here since last summer's Supreme Court Dobbs decision cleared the way for some state governments to prohibit the procedure. Vallis told today's lunchtime gathering at Gibson's Italia that he would appoint a deputy mayor for women's issues and create another new position near the top of the Chicago Police Department. I am going to appoint a deputy superintendent in the, in the police department to focus on the protection of women and children. And that deputy superintendent is going to be empowered and to have the resources to make sure that the department is focusing on the protection of the most vulnerable. Now, in terms of creating a deputy mayor for women's issues, uh, a few weeks ago, candidate for mayor Chewy Garcia was one of those who also proposed doing that. I'm political editor Mike Flannery.